Meet the Karens who took racism to a whole new level, caught on camera in all their cringeworthy glory. From parking lot meltdowns to grocery store showdowns, these Karens never fail to entertain with their epic fails and outrageous rants. Number 1 was at the Seattle airport waiting for his flight to Dallas when it got delayed. Instead of waiting patiently, he caused such a scene that people moved away from him and reported him to airport staff. Denied boarding because of his antics, Letney completely lost it, ranting about starting a race war. He's got some type of mental disorder. Letney's racist rant quickly alerted the police, and within minutes, officers were swarming his location. This, this patriot over here is ready to help. This guy's ready to help. Believe it or not, Letney has a long history of making anti-Semitic remarks online. He even wrote a racist book titled Nicholas Edward Letney's History of the World. Simply put, Letney's a very proud white nationalist. Like 
You never heard a book in your life. This is about the authority figure for your authority figures. You respect authors who read 250 music books. You don't put them on disability and break your law over and over again. That's a war crime. You land is going to date and wipe out your disabled resort country one day. So the two Scottish fill. The Americans would probably wipe it out. I think we should wipe out this whole dumb country and wipe out all three of them. The dumbest, most disabled resort who claim they have democracy, who claim they have bill rights. You didn't fall in the same world as us. You broke eight treasonous amendments. You can get eight death penalties. You got it? Now you let me go. It's my free speech right to be not. You don't have the right to throw me out the plane and violate my 14th right to life and privacy values. You violate that one big time. Number three. On the cold night of December 15, 2022, after a Christmas party celebration, legislator Nico Rios found himself behind the wheel, intoxicated. The festivities had dulled his senses, leading him to drift off the road on his way home. Suddenly, the flashing lights of a police car appeared behind him, abruptly ending his careless journey. How's it going, bud? What are you looking for? Look for his registration. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can go in the glove box if you need to. Hey, I'm not trying to give any of you guys in the comps. No, you're okay. Not. I'm just like I said, I'm going to give you guys my card just to let you know. No, nope, I don't want your card. I need your registration, buddy. Another secondary question. This is expired by like four months. It was evident that Rios was intoxicated due to his slurred speech, the presence of an open bottle in his car, and surprisingly, his admission to drinking alcohol. Despite these clear signs, the police decided to conduct a field sobriety test to assess the extent of his impairment. So I'm just going to test to make sure you're well when you do. You see the tip of my pen? And just look at the tip of my pen for a sec and just hold that. The bottom or top? The, the top, the tip of it. You can start. 1,002, 2,003, 3, 4, 5, 6. It was clear from Rios' performance that he was in no condition to be driving. Recognizing this, the officers decided to wrap up the encounter with a breathalyzer test. However, as soon as Rios realized what was happening, agitation began to bubble up within him. What I'm going to request is that you provide a specimen breath in uh, it's called an alcohol sensor, otherwise known as uh, a breathalyzer. Yes, sir. Are you happy to provide that? I'm not going to do that. You know why? Why is that? I'm speaking because I'm like two blocks away. Okay. You guys are on me. Okay. You, so know, you guys are going to you guys are going to regret picking on me. You know okay. what? Sir, this moment of time you're under arrest for DUI. Can I place my mind back? When Rio spoke, he didn't seem concerned about the possibility of being arrested. However, his mood shifted dramatically when he learned he wouldn't be taking his beloved truck home that night. Suddenly, he started hurling slurs at the officers, clearly upset and angry. How many? Oh, oh, yeah, sorry. I'm not there's, driving there's, that car yeah, we're, that we're, far. So this is the it's best literally like two blocks away. Listen, this is what I can do though. Instead of leaving it on that side, I can put it over there. I can put it right over there. When it's no, more I want to drop. Way. I want to drop my. All right, off right okay. no, we're not doing that. So we're gonna we're go to this vehicle. Oh, we're going. Here. Hey, I'll that's tell you what. That's the best. We're not moving the car. Those are, that's your only option. I'll drive it to my place. No. Now. I can't. No, I, I can't can We're not doing that. That's All right. Bad, no. no, 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 no. You good? Okay. Okay. Can you guys give me five seconds? Are you, you happy for us to park the vehicle? Can you give me five seconds? No. Okay, step in the car, bud. No, just get in. As you can imagine, the journey to the police station was far from peaceful for Nicholas Rios. Confined to the back seat of the squad car, an uncomfortable silence hung in the air. However, Rios broke the silence with an unsettling rant, making racist comments about the officer's home country, the United Kingdom. This escalated the already tense situation even further. Uh, I don't know what you mean. Are you proud to be from England? Yeah, I like my country. I have. What? Yes, I like my country. Are you proud to be English at least? Why is that relevant? Because. Why? Here in North Dakota, people. Despite Rios' yelling, it came as no surprise that the officer wouldn't back down. In the end, Rios was charged with driving while intoxicated and resisting a chemical test. He faced a $1,000 fine and nearly a year of unsupervised probation. Number 4. On May 9, 2019, multiple members of Mary Mars Montgomery County Police Department responded to a report at a McDonald's in Silver Spring. The report claimed that a group of black men were loitering outside the restaurant. Upon arriving, the officers detained the men and proceeded to search them. Now, I, I, what did I just tell him? I told him to 
hold him. I'll be out here in a minute. Are you, is it hurting you? Are you hurt? I'm not hurt. Well, then stop crying. You act like a little girl. Are you acting like a little girl? That's not nice. I'm not doing nothing. So, like, you don't mind, and I'm waiting to go to work, and y'all here doing the most of what? You ain't doing nothing. Yeah, I'm not. Nothing. Sit down there. Sit on the floor. All right. Big dog. Big dog. Yeah. Unbelievable. You know, trying to help out, get you guys out, you can get to your jobs. That's why I have to run your mouth. Right? You got you. No, you ain't in there, you ain't you're right smart. There. No, you're not. <laughs> if y'all stop running your mouth, <laughs> because, because, you because that will get you out of here. Is your, is your goal? Is your goal to get out of here sooner? Listen, just run me so I can go. Is your goal to get out of here sooner? So I can go. Run me so I can go. Okay, so you're not repeating yourself. You're just elongating this entire conversation, right? So here's the thing: if you just stop and listen, stop running your mouth, will get there faster. But just repeating yourself over and over again and not listening isn't going to get you anywhere. I am doing my job right now. I'm talking hey, to you. You know what? Do I know you? No. I know that joke right there ran his mouth. I'm coming deep, all right? Because I don't know anything. All right? Hey, baby. All right. I want to get you a good word. Follow me. So many calls. I got to deal with it. You understand? According to reports, the men stated they were waiting for someone to pick them up for work when a McDonald's employee called the police on them. Yeah, I do. And actually, uh, what's your idea? It was a real problem. You know, it came like this. Would you be quiet so I can hear? He doesn't want to leave. He wants us to stay longer. That's well, why we'll stay longer. I mean, I ain't got no problem. I get paid till four. What do you got? What's your idea, uh, date of birth? Why don't you got paper? Why don't you got paper? I can't run you off your hand. Oh, I got you. Here, give me that. You're going to have that pad of paper. I'm good. Okay. Don't mind. Just run these in. Sorry? What year? What number? What year? 93. Okay, I thought you said. Sweetheart. I was making sure that he got the same number that what you said because I didn't want to get no return and then have to ask you more and ask you again, okay? So that's why I'm asking you What's that? to yeah, verify. We're good? Okay. What are you? Is this you? Okay. Two last names? Uh, I mean, it all depends. I was a doctor, so sometimes it just shows up as women, sometimes it shows up as women. What do you go by? Do you have a... Um, Middle name? Alright, so why? Is it, is, it, is it a certain reason why I got my phone? Like, I got everybody else. Hey, everybody I'm else got it. Now, stop going over my, there. I'm no talking about my last name. Is, my last name is. I'm, t I'm cooperating with you. I'm telling you my name. Yeah, but don't be. Alright, don't worry about it, bro. Because y'all throwing me off about nothing. Yeah, Rob and Y'all worry about us. Like, I'm going to tell you. Tell me. Step off. That's what you need to do. Ain't no way. Hi. The men were visibly displeased with being detained and having their property searched. However, instead of defusing the situation, the officers continued to antagonize them. Thank you. You want to check my height or something? Your height? Sutton. S U N T I N. I need a number. Here you go. Now we're talking English. Get. Wait, one more time. I don't know how much I weigh. I really don't. You see, I say about 110 at most. Hey, was that on Snapchat? Because you got to get my good side if you're going to be on Snapchat. If you're on Snapchat, make sure you add me or tag me or you know what I mean. Just ask me, did I make it to work? Did I tell her no? As a kind moment, I'm getting pressed enough to pull in. Hey. Because, like, no, I. Whose bag is this? Y'all do this every day with me. Seeing him in the back. If I your bag, I'm gonna check. Has, it, has it been checked yet? Cool. That's not what we're doing. It don't matter. If I didn't want to be in, if I was lost, I would have ran from y'all. Like, come on now. I would have caught you. Not slick. We need to race. You and I are gonna race. How am I trespassing? Little all us. Well, that's what's happening. Is that right? That's cool. Go ahead. Continue your job, sir. Go ahead. I'm Okay, go ahead. You're one angry individual. Because I'm an angry individual. That's what the Yeah, what? Why are you so mad? Wait, wait, what you gotta do? 
Pass up for me. What you doing, wow. these? I'm gonna feel moving though. That's why you got that strap in there. Uh, what does it do? Uh, what does it do? She might have about four boxes on top of So you call them all together? She likes straps. Yeah, I'm big into straps. Strap on, strap off. Lots of different straps. That's why I'm very well uh, versed in what straps do. Uh, someday when you grow up, maybe you'll be less angry. Eater. I'm a eater now. Um, it's good to be something. During the encounter, one of the men pulled out his phone and started live streaming. It was during this stream that one of the officers decided to use a racial slur, which quickly made the live stream go viral. Where at? He came to write a whole bunch of paperwork. <laughs> hey, we're trying to, you want to get out of here fast, right? So if we have more people, y'all been trying to something. You want to get out of here faster? We have more of our friends to help to get out faster. Right? Uh, no, one, that's one, one. I bet she had a badge on. She want to call us. No. <laughs> I would still say it because what I'm doing is repeating your word. Afterwards, the men were cited for trespassing and marijuana possession. There are no records indicating that the officer faced any disciplinary measures for using the racial slur. Don't forget to check out this next video!